Hi, I'm Pete May, president of Green Biz Group, and I'm here with Aaron Craig, vice president for Three Degrees. Aaron, great to have you here. Happy I've to be here. I've seen you at so many, over the years, um, so many energy events. Um, you've been in the energy space for a while, and I know um, you uh, have a lot of expertise in this field. You've probably seen a lot of things as the energy, in terms of how the energy market has evolved. Um, Tell me a little bit about your past working with energy and where it's led up to yeah. now. So, um, so early in my career, I was working uh, for corporates. Right? So I was mm. uh, doing sustainability for Sun Microsystems. We didn't call it that then. We right. called it environmental okay. work. Right. Um, and uh, at that time, you know, energy was all about making our products energy efficient and uh, our buildings energy efficient. Uh, there wasn't a lot of choice or ways to buy energy yeah. then. So we bought yeah. what, what was available to us. Um, and then leap forward, um, about 10, 12 years ago, I started doing you know, energy related work for yeah. you know, more as a consultant. Yeah. And at that time, renewable energy credits were really on, a, right. on an upswing, right? So people uh, concerned about climate change deeply and looking for ways to take action. And that's certainly a, a nice um, and simple to execute way to take action. Yeah. And so I've, I've really kind of uh, sh seen very directly the wave that's moved from first people realizing that they can take action, both yeah. at the consumer level and at the corporate level, and then refining like what kinds of action should we take? Like what yeah. is the way to have the biggest impact? And over the last 10 years or so, like seeing that change from you know, ways that you can transact really simply to ways right. that you can do it in a more complicated way but maybe has more impact. Well, let's talk about that complicated because I've seen you in action at events and I, I think one of your skills, which is really important in this space, is this stuff can be really arcane and renewable energy can be really arcane, complicated, um, and it's, it's intimidating, I think, if you're not a larger corporation that's already deep into this. So what, what advice do you give, you know, the bright, broad swath of, of green biz companies that are starting to either toe dip or get active in renewables, how do you, how do you distill it down into uh, the yeah. essence of what's, yeah. Yeah, so, um, you know, it's a, uh, it can be complicated, but it certainly doesn't have to be. And so yeah. what, what we do with companies is just explain the different ways they can bring renewable energy into their supply portfolio. And yeah. there's a limited number of those. It's really like, depending on how you bucket it, call it five, five or six ways. And some of them are really complicated and involve right. large financial commitments and complicated contracts and lots of stakeholders. And some of them are much simpler. And it's really, uh, uh, for the Green Biz members, it's really the first step is introspection, right? To, to mm -hmm. understand what is, what's right. gonna be right for you. Yes. Like, is it something that is, is worthy of your time and effort to do a long-term contract or not, right? Yeah. If, if electricity is not that important to you and you've got lots of things on your plate yeah. that you can save the world with, then you know, do the things that, that are most important. Yeah. And so we help companies discover that, yeah. like, like and, how, and how to do it in the way that's gonna be most uh, effective given their time, attention, resources. And I think a lot of people know three degrees from the work you've done in renewable energy, but you're starting to apply that to transportation. Tell me what you're seeing, the opportunity you're seeing in yeah. transportation. Yeah, well that's actually a little bit more client-led, you know, mm -hmm. which is to say uh, some of our clients who we serve their renewable energy needs and helping them get to 100% or whatever their goal is. Um, you know, they also see that uh, a huge source of, their, of emissions is their fleets, right? right. Corporate fleets. And uh, as they sort of feel like their renewable energy and their electricity is under control, they are immediately like looking over their shoulder at that other giant source of emissions in the background. And so we've, um, we've started to help some of our larger customers look at their fleets in, in that, just like they would look at a, a building, right? Yeah. Which is to say, okay, here's a source of emissions. Uh, what are my options for, for eliminating those emissions? And so uh, electrification is something that thankfully, like elect electrification of vehicles, is something that is uh, now possible, yeah. right? For, yeah. And there's enough vehicles on the market that you can actually execute it. There need to be more, no mistake, but there are lots of different kinds of vehicles on the market to meet corporate's needs. And so it's really almost like like planning a rooftop solar portfolio where you're just, you're, you're, the, the key is where do we get the upfront investment yeah. for charging or whatever it is we need for changing out the vehicles uh, and where should we do it first, right? Yeah. So we have to wrap pretty, but you've been around this space for a long time. Um, 
with all we're seeing around climate, are you, does, does your work and what we're reading about on climate, are you optimistic or pessimistic? Yeah, so I, I, I get um, perturbed by, um, uh, you know, the climate is such a, 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 a fearful topic, right? Yeah. You know, there's a lot right. of, of fear and I, I, believe me, I get it. Um, but the other, but the flip side of that is every little bit helps, every little bit. It's yeah. not like there's, uh, we're not lost if we don't hit a particular target, right? right? We're, we're lost if we give up, yes. right? So, well so every, every step makes a difference and everybody can take a step. Yeah. So I just, I just think that's incredibly exciting. And, I, and I'm like a, a community like this one, the, all the hundreds and hundreds of people here this week, yeah. I mean, that's, that's amazing, yeah. right? And so how could you not be optimistic? That's great, we wanna tap into that. Aaron Craig, Three Degrees, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Yeah.